Over this door you see on the next, um, they murder the boy. That was his work, I think. That's what he does, I think, within this area. Okay. Staying and murdering the boy. Mm. So worried about my life living here. You're worried about your life? Yeah. Why? Why are you worried about your life? Because of the thing that is going to, that is happening now. Mm. What are those things that are happening? They are killing each other now for us who does enough energy. Mm. We need to get some little money. Mm. Well, how will you be? Mm. There is a man who has been killed one week ago before this man, even here. Mm. Yeah, and this man was here, but what is my little one? Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Ah, guys, it's windy. Yeah, it's windy. So we are heading to Namongo. Uh, Namongo Slam, guys. Um, today I'm gonna be checking out a group of uh, some youth over there. As you know, we have some projects that I I normally do over there. I check out on them, so that's where we are heading to. Yeah. And there is some girl I made a video with recently, and her story touched somebody from America. So that person wants to support her. So that's why I'm also going to see her and talk to her welcome to the channel if you're new here thank you so much for clicking my name is harriet i am from uganda and if you're a returning subscriber as already thank you so much guys for joining here yeah. so that is it guys basically gonna be sloping down yeah. Actually, this route I'm taking, I've never taken this route, but hopefully it will lead me where I am going. Mm -hmm. To lead me where I am going. Hello, how are you? You're fine? Yeah. Guys, it's really so sad. Um, over this door, you see on the next, um, they murdered the boy. And when was that? On Monday, he was run. He was working in the saloon. So how old was the boy? Twenty-three years. So did they get the person who murdered him? They ran away, but one was. The new one mm. was assigned to the chamber of this place. Okay. So, and, and I'm told that because when I was sloping down from the other side, I'm told that the, this boy has been murdering a lot of people. Like, so how many people? That was his work, I think. He was hit. Like, that's what he does, I think, within this area. Okay. And murdering people. So, how about you? You are the neighbor. How do you feel and that day when that boy was murdered, do you sleep here? Mm. So how do you feel? That is my nephew. Mm, it's your nephew. Oh, sorry about that. Sorry, sorry. So what is the family thinking about? There is nothing to do. Mm. I'm so sorry. Oh, so I think maybe... Uh, they have to deploy at least the police, the security, more security in this place so that uh, people can can be protected and secure because now I feel like the security, people need security. Mm. And there's no security here. There's no security. So how long has this... Sometimes they do patrols, but they can patrol today, then they go to another place. Mm. And even them, they, they know. So when was this boy murdered? Monday morning. Like at our time? Midnight. I'm oh, so sorry about that. So sorry. Guys, it's really so sad, you know. A young boy at 23 years who has done nothing, you know, nothing and who was just killed. I think that guy was a thief, eh? was a thief he wanted maybe something so that boy was working in a saloon they took you in his phone i think they they took the phone mm. plus i think other phones of other people also, they were taken oh so sad guys that is really very, very bad you know i'm even feeling so sad right now you know 
a, a young boy like that and he was murdered just on Monday, you know, and this boy has been murdering a lot of people. So this place is not really safe. And even uh, at the uh, railway uh, side, guys, when we were sloping, I think you saw, I'm also told around that place, it's not safe like at the, starting from 10, if you're moving at night at 10 p.m., you can be robbed. There is a group of uh, boys. So it's like a, there is a gang of boys who do so many. Oh. They stay behind the other side. So during daytime, they are like... Uh, you don't see them at this time, but during the evening hours. Evening hours. Nine, nine, five, them, taking the jagai. Yeah. Okay. Oh, so they smoke marijuana. Then at night they start stealing, killing and 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 uh, stealing people. And I'm also told that uh, there's another girl who was also murdered. It's really very bad to hear such a hurting stories you know innocent people are being robbed are being killed that is really not nice guys yeah so it's really a sad story you know i was sloping down there to go and see those of Ama and i i bumped into ah this is really not nice guys hmm. guys this is not nice yeah, even us, we are not because there's a time they had to bang, they had to like dig that shop up, they had to open it. They dug your shop? Yeah, they dug up. it up to open it. To open it. They wanted to steal. Oh! So they are very serious boys who stay within us. Hmm. That's not nice. That's not nice. Okay. So area needs like... It needs a lot of security. Okay. Do you have they be there like every day, not like one one of them. Like mm. permanent. Yeah? Mm. At least there. Okay. Do you have a picture of the boy who has killed? I just have a look. Huh? We took all the photos They took all the photos. That's not nice, guys. Okay, thank you so much. Eh? I really feel so bad and so hurt, guys, to hear such hurting stories. Indeed, the place is not safe. Eh? When they tell you that the place is not safe, indeed, it's not safe. So you have always to be more careful, you know. Yeah. It's really very bad. I feel even so hurt, eh? more than hurt, guys. I don't even know how to explain this, but it's really very bad. Silent travel. Silent travel. What does this mean? <laughs> silent meaning when you're traveling, you have to be silent. <laughs> guys people can write mm -hmm. I don't know basically where to take whether to take this route whether to take this route ah, yeah just guys moving around yeah? Yeah, keeping keeping around let's take this route guys hope we are safe eh? and our phone is safe How are you? You're fine? Can we take one at Lina Kuali into Alapakawa? Once here? Okay. There is so. Let's see. Mwale? Away at the body, yeah. You was all a kunyaga. Munangi and Baden Vedi never number one woman lens go basse. Take us on our bivand in our batem. Baby, how are you? <laughs> the baby is running out. <laughs> Mammy and Gamma, I love you, Munanga Mukatundu. Eh, mm. it's <laughs> on you. Ah. Nanga guys, you know? 
honest, to be honest, I've never been terrified like today. Just after hearing that bad news to what exactly happened to that uh, young boy, you know, it feels like he's my own blood, like my own brother. That's really so sad. I feel so bad. I don't know how I can explain this, but it is so painful. <laughs> Hi. Yeah. So what do you think about the area? Do you think this place is really safe? I think this place is not safe. Mm. Because who doesn't have energy and money? Mm. Mm. That's what I think. Mm. I'm so worried about my life living here. You're worried about your life? Yeah. Why? Why are you worried about your life? Because of the thing that is going to that is happening now. Mm. What are those things that are happening? They are killing each other now for us who doesn't have energy. Mm. When if you get some little money, mm. well, how will you be? Mm. Yeah, that is it. So even they are killing innocent people who don't have even money. As long as you have money and you don't have energy, mm. that way they will come and kill you. They don't arrest those people who kill others who do theft. In fact, those people like their children, those leaders. Ah. Oh. Chairman, chair is the one who did that thing. The boy who killed the other one was a charm, a chairman's son. Yeah. So was he arrested? No. Mm. He ran away, but the father was been beaten. The father is beaten. Uh, Seriously. And up to now, he's in oxygen. He's in oxygen. Mm. Ah. This place now needs those who have energy. Mm. Because I swear he was full of boxing boxing club. But that boxing club is not promoting anyone. Everyone is just learning to beat and kill. Mm. Yeah, they are there always, every day. Every day. Now for us who doesn't have energy, you have not to move at night. Mm. You have to keep yourself inside at around 8 you enter. Mm. So that God also can try his best from that side. Mm. But moving at night, this, this place is... It is bad. risky. So risky. Mm. Ah, and I pity like uh, girls, eh? Indeed, if you don't have energy, you can't uh, do anything. Even being with that smartphone like that in this area and you move at night, mm. which means your life is in house, even they can kill you that reason just because of that. Phone. Because of just a smartphone. Mm. Ah, so. Being with phone here, yeah. mm. I have a lot of fear. Mm. Ah, guys, that is terrifying, you know. Ah, I came with the energy, but immediately when I heard such news, guys, I was terrified. Even up to now, I still have fear in my heart. Like, I'm, I'm even, uh, honestly speaking, I'm not, you guys, you're laughing, but I'm really in pain. Yeah, we were scared. Even for and, us that day, we were so scared because everyone was and, uh, and I'm told several times that even recently, there's a girl they killed. A girl. There is a man who has been killed one week ago before this man, even here. Mm. Yeah, and this man was here, but what is my one? Mm. Ah. So it's a lot of killing, killing, and robbery. Yeah, we are so scared living in this place. Mm. So should someone come and rent in this place or no? I don't support anyone to come and rent here. Mm. Me of this place, if you want to live. Mm. And how for you support someone to come and rent. Mm. It's not safe. Which means if you want to stay here, you have to connect with those people so that they steal mm. you, buy mm. when you mm. have money. Mm. So that way you will be safe. Mm. Mm. Yeah. That is really bad, eh? It's really bad. Thank you so much eh, for your opinions, eh? But otherwise, I pray you, you'll be safe, eh? You see, recently I made a video of uh, one of the girls in the area and um, her story was really touching and someone wants to support her. So that person had requested if I can talk to her, if it is okay with her. And so that is the main reason why I came here. So to meet her and here she is today. <laughs> Julian, she has, she's removing her hair by the way. Yeah. How are you Julian today? I'm good, how are you? You're doing well? Yeah, I'm doing How is well. everything? 
are you happy are you excited that person yeah, is going I'm to support so, you so happy. <laughs> yeah so happy i'm also happy for you you know guys the reason why we make these videos uh you never know who is watching you know like uh, for her there's someone who who watched her from america and that person wants to support her so that is how god does his things you know now julian you have a person who is going to support you <laughs> really happy yeah i would like to appreciate that person though mm. i've not yet communicated with yes anything, yeah I'm yeah really yeah. Grateful, yeah 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 it's really nice yeah i can't wait also to see your life change you know to be a, ba a better person you know because we are all aiming to be better people you know yeah so guys that was it i just came to see them and also yeah to check out other girls like you can see they are over there yeah so that is it so julian um we shall keep in touch eh? and oh, please also keep updating me do you have my contact yeah keep also updating me what will be going on you know yeah yeah Ah, so guys that was all about the video i hope you have enjoyed the video guys uh, subscribe like share <laughs> until again we meet next time guys Bye.